So again, I ended up at the grocery store not doing a delivery. But I was out and about and it was early, so I figured I would just get it done. you I've got all my groceries here that I need to unload and put away I will show you look how cute let me put the open the other one and get it put in there I didn't take the tags off but cute now it looks like I am ready to bake but I didn't store that away because I used it for Thanksgiving and I left it out and I thought you know some little Christmas spatulas would look cute in there so there they are okay I'm hiding hiding from you I just woke up and took off out the door today no makeup so I got some organic seasoned croutons. I usually get quinoa croutons, but my kids love croutons, like just eating them with salads and stuff. So I decided to get regular kind this time. And then I got, and I wasn't walking around the lost now. I just took it off a minute ago. I got this, oh, you know what? I think I got one of these before and I didn't like it. But it's a sheet pan meal, chicken with garlic and potatoes. Chicken with garlic and there's uh, cauliflower and green beans too. So we'll see if that's any good. Actually, I really think I got this and I hated it, but I can't remember. Hmm. Oh well. We'll just have to hate it again. But this would be something easy to just throw on a pan and cook for dinner when I'm like, what am I going to make? So I got two bags of it. This is one bag. That ain't enough. So I got two bags of that. I'm gonna stick in the freezer. Oh my gosh, I have to clean out the freezer. There's no room in here. I don't know what to do. There's no room in my freezer. I've got an out two freezers out there, but I don't want to go out there. They're full too, I think. I got lettuce, this stir fry kit um, that I make with the General Tso's and orange chicken, these big boxes of it that I get at Target. I didn't make a Target order, but I haven't picked it up yet. So I'm gonna make that with the, the chicken from Target and um, some white rice. Got a bag of jalapeno peppers. 
I want to grill some. We are obsessed with jalapenos, my husband and I. I got a couple nice, big, pretty green peppers. I love green peppers. I used to have a huge garden. Like, I think I had 18 green pepper plants. And I mean, those things, they get pretty big. I had like 18 green pepper plants, like 18 to 20 tomato plants, like so many things. They were huge, but the smell of a green pepper, oh, I don't know what it is. I love that smell. So good. Got some instant Toll House chocolate chip cookies. Gonna stick in the fridge. Wow, guys, my fridge and freezer need cleaned out. It, it is bad. Got some salsa verde. Some ground beef. This is the kind of ground beef I get. It's the organic ground beef. I think this, you get three pounds and it's like $18. Is that a lot? <laughs> I don't know. I like this. I'm weird about meat. I don't. I don't know, meat like grosses me out, so I like that. I'm happy with it. Chocolate milk for the kids. Some cauliflower to snack on. Mini cucumbers for snacking and salads. Some ranch seasoning that is life. I know I'm dairy free. This is the, I, I still have this. I feel like, does this really count? Um, tomatoes, pickles. I love these Clawson mini pickles and so do my kids, but I, I don't think I pay attention to prices when I'm at the store, not typically at the grocery store, but these are like $4.50 a jar. I got $2, that's like $9 in pickles. It's crazy, seems crazy if you think about it. Dairy-free sour cream cream cheese that I wish, well I am gonna eat actually. I I got this just to go ahead and grab it for Christmas um, cause I'm gonna make ham roll ups and cheese ball again, my weaknesses, but I only make those for Christmas and Thanksgiving. And then yeah, one's for my husband's cake. <laughs> I say my husband's cake, but it's his cake. I got some strawberry lemonade. I did order some orange juice from Target. I like the orange juice with pineapple in it and they didn't have that at Kroger. I don't even think they sell it. This is my favorite, oh my gosh, this is my favorite lettuce. I don't know why. Do you have a favorite a favorite lettuce? But it is um, the Little Jim lettuce. I don't know. I don't know what that means, but I love that lettuce. We got two bunches of green onions because green onions are amazing. Got a sweet yellow onion and a red onion. Oh gosh, and the chips. Tortilla chips for salsa. But my children just want to devour them. I got cheddar jalapeno chips. The chips were like, okay, the... the <laughs> Price on the shelf for these chips said $3.29 for a bag of chips. That's how much it costs. And they didn't have like little mini bags for the kids' lunches, which there's like two days of school left. But the kids want to snack on chips all the time. And the mini bags were sold out pretty much. Uh, so I was going to get some different kinds. And it said if you buy four or more, they were $1.88 a piece. So $3.82 for one bag or $1.88 for four or more. Okay, I'm buying four. So I've never had this kind, and it is dairy because it uh, is cheddar jalapeno, but I'm gonna try some. Gosh, look at me breaking all the rules. You know what, I feel like that's not so bad as apart from this. Um, got some everything bagels. More chips. I don't think I've had the cheddar jalapeno. The cheddar sour cream. Those were requested by one of my children. Wavy Play original. I don't even know where the rest of the chips went. Oh, I got two bags. 
of the favorite sweet southern heat barbecue. The best. And some extra crispy crinkle fries. My sister, I sent her a picture last night because I was at Chick-fil-A and we don't have one where we live. Ridiculous, right? But I, you have to go out of state or that's like pretty much the closest one. It's about 45 minutes away. So we went shopping at uh, the mall there, which was amazing. We don't really have a mall either. <laughs> I know, it's so sad. We have one mall left, but it's hopeless. But this mall, I was like, oh, I felt like I was in a Hallmark movie. It was just bustling with people. All the stores were like full and open and they had so many great stores. And their department stores were like decked out for Christmas. It was so beautiful. I'm like, oh my gosh, we are deprived here that we can't just shop here regularly. I mean, 45 minutes isn't that far away, but it's too far for me to like want to run to while the kids are at school. I don't know. I guess I could, but it was just so, so nice. And then my husband and kids went off somewhere and I was walking past Santa and he was by himself. And I passed Santa and looked at him and he just waved at me. Santa waved at me and he was beautiful. Um, and then when I was leaving, um, a woman was walking toward the door to go out of the, or and she was coming in the mall and I was going out and she just stopped and didn't come in and held it open for me. And I was like, thank you. And she's like, you're welcome, Merry Christmas. And I was like, oh, Merry Christmas. I don't know why, and that is so crazy, but I was like, I feel like I'm in a Hallmark movie. But anyway, all that story came from my meatballs. I got a five pound bag of meatballs. Uh, like I said, I got Chick-fil-A, sent my sister the picture, and she set, sent me a picture of what she made, which was meatballs. We, um, <clears throat> both of us make meatballs like in the crock pot with grape jelly and barbecue sauce, so good. Um, my kids love them. I haven't made meatballs in forever. So I literally spent like 10 minutes looking at the meatballs on what kind to make. They're like, I don't know. I don't know if I got the right kind. They're kind of creepy, but five pound bag of meatballs. So I'm gonna put those in the crock pot with grape jelly, barbecue sauce, not all at the same time. Um, I got some jalapeno tomatillo sauce, some salsa. Fancy expensive pickles. Got some Italian seasoned individually wrapped chicken breast, bananas, a big bunch of kale. You know, I uh, love lasagna and I make homemade lasagna, which I love. And since I stopped eating cheese, I really hadn't made it all that much but i made myself a um oh i made everybody else the cheesy lasagna and i made myself one with just the sauce and i put kale in it and you can't really even taste the kale it's just like it feels a little more substantial um my favorite salad dressing which is probably i'll show you My favorite salad dressing, which is probably super fattening, but ugh, it's so good. I can't have ranch, so let me have this. It's sweet Italian. It's really good. <clears throat> and I got Ritz crackers, and I realized I forgot to add coupons um, before I checked out, and there was a dollar off coupon for the Ritz crackers. <sighs> and I didn't clip it. Some uh, guacamole individual things. I got uh, my box of things. Some linen baby bunt cakes, hostess. Oh my gosh, these are so good. And then I got my husband and the kids, the cosmic brownies. Not the Christmas tree brownies, they had those, but my husband made an observation the other day and he was like, uh, he's like, are these cheaper than the other brownies? I was like, I don't know why. He's like, cause you, you get like half a brownie. Cause really you do, it's like they're taking this brownie and putting like a little cookie cutter in and chopping half of it off so you're paying. But they were kind of, they were 19 cents cheaper I think. 
just because they were on sale, but I was like, I'll take the whole brownie. It's the same thing. Well, we've had the Christmas tree brownies. Oh, and when I opened the Christmas tree brownies the other day, the individual package had like a little print on it. I don't know, I thought that was interesting. <laughs> I took a picture of it and sent it to my sister. Did you see the new little Debbie design? Um, I got a bag of oranges. Oh, I hit my head on that lamp. Bag of, bag of oranges and a bag of gold potatoes. I think that's it. Is that all I got? 186 bucks. And then I got some stuff that I'm gonna pick up from Target. So I'm gonna get this put away. Are you looking at all the weird stuff I have? All the weird condiments I have in my store. Um, oh, and I have pink trash bags. That's right. Styling with my trash. They have pink trash bags at Target, so of course I'm buying them. And they're scented. Um, let's see, I took a bunch of stuff out of here already this morning, but oh my gosh, I don't have any room for anything. Who's pizza? Pizza. Oh, these are my last week's cucumbers. Looking a little shriveled. Oh, yeah, that one, that one might be good. Why do I, I'm gonna transfer this butter into this butter. Wait, is the butter open yet? No, I'm just gonna throw that butter away because I'm over it. Got it. Got this better I've not opened yet. <sighs> yeah, I need, why do I have so much butter? I don't even eat butter. Uh, what, th these pickles were stuck in my fridge. All right. I'm taking everything out of the fridge. I noticed a weird smell coming from here. So, it's all coming out. We're getting to the bottom of this. Right here, right now. Exclusive footage. Why, am I, why do I do stuff like this? Is it necessary that I take everything out of my fridge? Actually, I think so. I'm not showing you what it looks like. This is pretty bad. Yikes. Yikes, leftovers. Oh my God, that's what I want to make tonight. Sheesh. We got salad. That's no good. It looked kind of good, but it's expired. That onion has seen better days. Milk, I just got that. Tequila, don't get this tequila. And there's no room for tequila in the fridge. Why does my husband keep tequila in the fridge? Oy vey. I'm Googling it. Where is my phone? I just got a message from the school that my child forgot his school lunch. Where does, where's that app? And asked if I could bring it. It is noon. Oh no, what time is lunch? Question mark. I don't have time to bring a lunchbox now. I'm in the middle of cleaning my fridge. And, oh yeah. Do you keep tequila refrigerated? Uh, uh, this is ridiculous. I'm mad. I'm literally mad at my husband. Cause you're not supposed, I told him this. He won't, he has to have it cold. Bob, there is no room for this tequila in the fridge. 
You are not even supposed to store it cold. I just Googled it. That's why people have liquor cabinets. They don't have their fridge filled with liquor. Oh, I've got, this expired. That's too damn bad. Is that a meme? He doesn't watch TikTok, so he doesn't know. That's too damn bad. Me with all my groceries out and the fridge alarm going off. Oh, that's a show. I don't watch TV. I found the meme. Well, that's too damn bad. Oh, God, you keep digging. Oh, that's what that's from. I imagine that being from like some weird cartoon like Rick and Morty or something. I've never even watched that, so that's why I imagine it. Okay, cleaning out the fridge. There's time to get the lunchbox to the school before, ah, oh, we bought lettuce, there's lettuce here. See, I don't know. I have to get, okay, okay. Let's see, I need cleaning supplies, stat. Can we disarm this alarm, please? It won't stop. So let me get these drawers soaking. Should take them out. I want to get this done in time. I've got like 30 minutes to clean this out. There's, cause there's a mess in here. What on earth? Who did this? Who put, who put an unopened thing of Hershey's syrup in the fridge when we have this ginormous thing? I sure didn't. I'll tell you that. And you can't unrefrigerate it now that it's been refrigerated. This is why I have no room in my tall section. Holy moly, I already had two things of cream cheese. Oh, I felt that. What? Why is it all slimy? This could be like one of those cute fridge clean out videos where it looks like I've got it all together, but in reality, this shit shows. He, he just sent me a laughing emoji in reaction to my uh, gif. Is that what it is? A gif. Where'd the cleaner go? This is insane. put it in the fridge. This is my favorite tequila. Um, I say that like I'm a connoisseur. I've had like two kinds. I know that I don't like that Jose Cuervo 1800 in my margaritas. It tastes like cheap. It tastes like candy, like blue raspberry. And it says it's blue agave on it. I don't, I don't like it. Oh, I didn't clean this out. Do you think there's... Oh no, I need to get more ranch dressing. I'm cleaning it out. <sighs> Woo! That was a double sneeze. This is getting out of hand. I think I've bitten off more than I can chew. Okay, only three minutes has passed. I'm panicking for no reason. So oh, dirty. I'm just be embarrassed and show you how dirty my fridge is. Which the lights off, and the camera's not focusing, but it is pretty, pretty gross in there. There's some sticky stuff, mystery sticky substance. Sneeze it.
now that everything's out, you might as well go in with something heavy duty. Wait, what's under this drawer? Oh, Lord have mercy. How do you get this drawer out? <laughs> what is that? Just cleanings, baby. Oh, there's FedEx. I hope they're bringing me something. Oh, mama. You don't want to know. There's kale under there. Male, everyone is here to see me. This calls for some Dr. Pepper. bad boy and it's gonna smell you know what I need a crisp where's my snow okay I'm gonna finish it off with some Mrs. Meyer snow scent lunch I guess somebody's oh, I wish I could do that that'd be a perfect opportunity if I can hurry up and throw everything in and then come back and fix it I think I might be able to pull off mom of the year award bringing McDonald's to school batteries going dead folks I will let you know how everything turns out whenever I just got to the school. I secured the bag, fixed my nail. He's gonna be so excited. <laughs> I'm back from the school. I had to take everything out that I put in the fridge. I didn't even put the drawers in. The things we do for our kids, right? I was wondering where my eggs went because I bought eggs and I left them in the car. They had slid forward where I couldn't see them. So I left my cookies and tortilla shells. And my 18 carton of eggs in the car and they fell. So hopefully they don't appear broken, but out of all the things, at least it wasn't anything really perishable. So my eggs are still cold. I also still haven't edited my vlog for this day because I usually do it at night. And um, last night, not last night, but the night before, I only got three or three and a half hours of sleep. So last night, I, we went out of state shopping and I was like, I have to get home. And I didn't vlog any of that. Or I was like, I have to get to bed at a decent hour, which was like 11 or 12. And so I didn't, so I didn't edit the video. And then I got up at like 6.30 this morning and I have not, not had a second since to like do anything. So hopefully, whenever I'm done with this, I will have time to eat something before I pick the boys up from school. And then 
I will edit the video when I get back. I don't even know what I'm editing, so. When I go with confidence, when I go the way around, I keep saying take my sip on it, take a trip on it. When I go, you can go slow. Bind it up on night. done and it's not organized because guess what it's impossible to organize real food and make it pretty I mean you could probably I mean it's just not realistic right I see people like pouring their milk and just pouring everything out into other things like no way I can't do that because I have to know the expiration dates and I am not logging all that in <laughs> I don't even know how you would keep track but um, salad dressings Chick-fil-A sauce up here, the essentials. Got my peppers, um, barbecue sauce, other condiments because I'm obsessed with sauces. So I threw a bunch away and I have more that I'll probably end up shoving in here. In this door, I've got my pickle collection right there. And then I just tried to put my mustards over here. I love mustard. Uh, I don't like how this one's leaning forward. That bothers me, but the ice maker's coming up, so... Um, that's where I put the mustard. I've got butter and garlic together. You know, perfect combination. Got my eggs up here. More butter. Sour cream. So, we got chicken back there. Cinnamon rolls. Don't know where I'm going to put this stuff, guys. I, I'm going to go on Pinterest if I ever get a free moment today and look up some, like, fridge organization. I put snacks up here. I think I will get some little bins for snacks. I always put the snacks down here, but I have so much meat and cheese and it's, uh, you can select it so I, it's the same temperature. Um, I put the meat and cheese in this pullout thing because it's so ugly, you know? It just looks so trashy up here. So all this crap cheese that uh, my boys have to have, yuck. And my psychotic uh, cream cheese collection got my ground beef here for dinners this week actually if I don't use it I'll put it in the freezer cheese I don't know deer sausages we got um, some shredded cheese lunch meat got bacon so everything in here is vegetables I've got my kale lettuce and green peppers in there and then a bunch of other vegetables in this drawer I've got some more fruits and vegetables I just basically put stuff where I could fit it and this ugly chocolate syrup, I'm hiding that. I don't want to look at it and there's two because they put an unopened one in there, remember? Guys, I know you probably have seen just a shadow of my face this entire video, but I kept it that way. I am getting a little tired. It's 1.30. I've been on the go ever since I jumped out of bed this morning at 6.30 a.m. So I've got the fridge cleaned out and all this stuff still needs to go in the pantry and I've got to throw it all away. I don't know if I'll share that with you, but if not, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right here because I've got to get some lunch. So thank you guys so much 
for watching this video. Really hope you've been enjoying Vlogmas and just kind of getting little bits of my day-to-day -day activity. Um, if you like this video, please give it a, a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification so you don't miss out on a video and I will see you again tomorrow. Bye.